Hi Pro Zero here, I am welcome to this let's play of Need for Speed Most Wanted. Uh, if you're asking yourself, what's been of that wonderful green, water green, you know, sea green Chevrolet of the, that you had, well, the fact is a lot of things happened. Uh, I'm gonna tell you uh, uh, where uh, while I start the first race. Uh, what happened I is that as as usually I was trying to do the um, the milestones for uh, well the the speed traps milestones off, uh, off screen and I said okay it is gonna be easy and and all you know as usual it's gonna be very easy and I don't need to record it everyone can you know easily see to how to do it and then what happened here is that during the second milestones milestone that I wasn't able to do quickly, apparently it was kind of horrible in that, I started to be chased uh, by police and that was actually a long chase, basically uh, six minutes maybe and, and yeah, after all that long chase, which by the way I evaded uh, as I'm supposed to, I didn't get busted but yeah, after that I decided to, to use a new car for, for that milestone which I wasn't able to to do beforehand and and so I I bought my favorite car which is Supra well favorite car in this game at least which is this the Toyota Supra and I also felt that you know some other color on screen is gonna be more you know fresh I needed some fresh colored car which even if if green is my favorite color I just wanted some new color on screen and so that's what happened. So I got a lot of screen. I got the two milestones, and I got this new car, which, by the way, is already powered to the maximum, uh, and it still has a horrible handling. As usually, Supra has a horrible handling, but but that's that's okay because you know Supra is thought for the the drifting, and not for the the racing itself. Well, for the speed racing, or I don't know. Okay. It's tough for drifting, and so yeah, a lot of things happened off screen without even wanting it. I I had to do a lot of stuff, but anyway, uh, well, when you when you will hear this, it'll probably be from a lot of time. But anyway, one of my most loyal viewer, which is what now, punk? Uh, let's see, eleven oh six maybe. I'm trying to remember the number, which is the hardest part. <laughs> anyway, I'm probably gonna correct myself in the annotations if I misspelled it. But it should be what now, Punk 1106 or 06, whatever. And uh, start a new uh, a ne uh, let's play. So go check it out. Uh, the game is Star Wars: The Complete Saga. So so yeah, I had that game for the DS. And by the way, I completed the race. I had that game for the DS and. It was a cool game, but it was darn glitchy for the DS. Sometimes, well, sometimes there were kind of small glitches that you could continue, you could continue playing um, easily. Sometimes there were actually horrible glitches, and the the floor disappeared, and you weren't able to continue the game. You were stuck until you reset. But the GameCube version seems a lot more, you know, stable. It's a lot better. I suppose that the DS processing capabilities are not that good, but even even with that, uh, the developers made a horrible use of them. Even if the, if the DS is not that powerful, they used it kind of horribly. But I, I think this, the, the developers of the two versions are different. Yeah, I'm almost sure that the, the two versions were developed by two different teams. And as usually happens, because you know, there is one team that uh, does the the console, well, the ha no, the handheld uh, versions, and the one other team that does the the console versions. So that's it. But the GameCube version, as I said, is a lot better. So go check it out. It's a quite good game, I think. And go check it out, of course, the Let's Play, which is the main reason why I'm saying it now. I'm not trying to, you know advertise games, I'm just trying to talk about let's players and let's plays and that's about it about that and by the way I'm third again why why do I always end up being third 
Oh, I forgot to read the names again. Yeah, I'm sorry if I'm not reading them uh, lately. I, it's just that I don't pay attention to that part of the, the screen very much. Okay, Hildebrand, Illusion, and Smoke Show. Again, quite strange nicknames. Oh, police? Are we going to get? Are we going to get chased by police? Hmm. Oh, speaking of police, uh, I think I already said that. I'm not sure. Anyway, uh, during the pursuit I got uh, with the off-screen, the off-screen pursuit, I got the third levels of suspect. So I w we're probably gonna see it, um, you know, very soon. Well, not very soon, but soon enough. So, so that's just. To you know, to say you, to tell you that you're gonna see it. <laughs> Don't worry, you're gonna see it anyway in the challenges, but you're gonna see it even f uh, before that. Okay, we're almost done, and sadly we're still gonna get chased by police. That's bad. Let's try to. Yeah, uh, I cannot. I cannot. Okay, let's try to do this because you basically continue exactly in the direction you're going uh, at the end of the race, as you can. See now, okay. Let's try to evade quickly. Oh, I'm ready. Oh, well, not ready. Uh, with a super ammo level first uh, of su suspect, because you know, every single car has its own level of suspect. So, uh, customizing the car, uh, especially uh, visual custom customization, basically um, lowers your level of suspect. So, that's a good idea if you're. You know, at a very high level of suspect, and you don't basically cannot even run by a me meter that you're already getting chased. Then try to customize your car, and you're probably gonna get uh, a lower. Well, you're surely gonna get a lower level of suspect, but or just buy a new car as I did. But I didn't do it for that, as I already said. Okay, this is. Need, this isn't needed since you know it's completely. I already did a lot more than the needed bounty for easy. And by the way, I forgot to mention it, but I love how the the graffiti for easy name looks like dizzy. <laughs> yeah, it's very similar. But I think I'm pretty sure that is done on purpose. I don't think it's done by accident. Yeah. And I evaded. Thanks. And since we are level 1, the cooldown is very quick. Okay, and whoa, surprisingly, we're already, well, not really that surprisingly, but we're already able to to challenge the next rival, which is easy. No, speaking of her, uh, we have time probably w w for one race only. I don't know how many. Let's see. Come on, save. Blacklist 15. Challenge rival. We have a sprint and a circle. Uh, yeah, probably we are going to do only the sprint one. Let's see. I'm not able to predict the future, but I can. I'm good at math. Okay, I'm very good at math usually. Loading. Oh, the usual intro, which I cannot skip. So don't even ask. And of course, uh, she's showing up like, like rivals usually do. Come on, girl, get ready. Okay, she has a Mazda RX-8, and I failed a perfect launch, but that doesn't matter since I'm first anyway. Okay, uh, I think th there is actually an odd thing uh, on the. Um, Bio of the bio bio I think bio uh, uh, of the of easy there is um, they say basically that her best type of race her favorite type of race is uh, knockout lap knockout but none of the of her race uh, rival races are lap knockout the first is a sprint and the second is a circuit so I don't get it really but whatever oh this is actually a cannot you know difficult race, not because she's that good or fast, but because it's full of t 
tight turns. And of course she passed me. But I should be able to win anyway. Let's try. Let's use our nitro carefully. Come on, easy, come here. Come here, little girl. Well, not really little. I don't know <laughs> how old is she. You don't ask girls how old are they, don't you? Do you, rather? Do you? Yeah, do you? No, get away from my way. Get away from my way. <laughs> I never heard that. Get away from me or get out of my way. Now get away from my way. Oh, she's doing that thing that I told you last time, which is base maneuver. And she did it quite well because I completely, you know, lost speed and direction. Dang it. I I hope she doesn't get too far because the super is fast but it's very hard to turn if you're especially if you're not accustomed to it. And since I'm used to the you know Chevrolet now it could be hard, but I think I can pass her if I do very, very, very good. Come on, come on! God, that was not quite enough. Okay, I'm not gonna cut the the first attempt because you know this is a blacklist race, so I'm gonna leave out, leave all the attempt, every single attempt uh, in the video, since we're all, we're going quite quickly. And one attempt is not that bad. If I fail again, <laughs> I'm not gonna uh, leave both attempts though. I only did that in part 9. I think it was, yeah, it was part 9. The special double part, which was full of failures. That was kinda sad. Oh well. Uh, I suppose that could be considered like the, the Let's Play course that Chaga always talk about. I'm not suffering of it very much, uh, to be honest. Okay, I'm not as good as I usually am at this game, but I'm not doing that badly. At least, I don't think so. And watch me lose, as I said that. By the way, uh, yeah, so I'm not suffering from it very much. But yeah, I, I can understand what it, what it means. I mean, talking about things and at the same time playing is not that easy. Especially in games where you need a lot of concentration, you know. Play let's play in Tetris could be a Tetris could be a nightmare. Probably there are some Tetris let's play. I don't know. I'm gonna do a YouTube search after this recording and see if there are. I'm gonna commentate about it. But yeah. I wonder if anyone does any let's live let's play of Tetris because you know you you need to talk and at the same time you need to be very focused on the game because in Tetris a single bad move can cost you thousands of pints. Yeah. So you need to be very careful. I don't know really if it's possible to do that. Well, it is possible, okay, but I don't know if it's acceptable to do it. And I won this time, so no let's play of course for me. Sorry. I don't have time to for the other one. No, I don't have. So so yeah, you're gonna see in the next part. Uh, Hyper K0 here, thanks for watching, goodbye.